the good thing about uh, the butterfly funnel is amazing again, right? I don't need to change too much. I will change the way I make my grips. And after I have the grips, uh, the grip will be pretty much the same. Okay, I don't need to worry about too much. All right? Uh, the grip I'm gonna make now, give me the opportunity to grip the guys in two different ways was amazing because like, if I force Monique to block me from one side, I'll be able to speak to her right there from the other side, okay? I will show both at the same time, and they're gonna play a little bit on that too, all right? Let's work on the, on the grips, all right? Of course, butterfly, I need to have my hook inside. I'm start with the hand behind the head, the other hand on the, the wrist, okay? I wanna hook one arm younger. Does that matter what arm you're looking at? Now, most of the time, I like to hook my right arm younger. How do I do? I force Monique to post the hand, like Alexa said, right? That's important for me because I know if Monique is on her butt, she can screw up and start to move. If I force her to pose, she needs to stop and that time I can reach in transition for that effect, okay? I'm gonna just push the head and push the hand, that way she's gonna pose. I go under, and then I like to cut the shoulder, or I like to go all the way behind the back. Now, I need to load in her because I'm, a, oh my, my, I'm in my butt already, but too far away from her. I wanna get a closer. That's the most important thing about butterfly. Most of the people who do really well butterfly, they always almost underneath the person. If I'm away like that, I have no angle, no, no pressure to sweep. I need to get a close, okay? I'm gonna be here, how do I get a close? I'm lean backwards with my toes on her butt, I'm gonna drag her and bring my knees towards to my shoulder. I'm going here. See how close she is now? Now I have a lot of control. I can leave it to her, not because she's light, but I can do whatever. Okay? I will keep the hand here, and the other hand now, I'm gonna wrap her, and then I like to hold my, my hip from here, right in the bone. Okay, guys, pretty much, I put my hand on that bone in the other side. Okay, that way, look, it's important to guys be above the elbow. That way, when this cannot pull her elbow out. Okay, I'm here. All right? Now, I'm just waiting for her. Whatever way she go, I can choose the other side, okay? If she lean on this side, what are you doing? I lift my elbow, my right leg will kick you over, and my bottom leg, that's important too, guys. I'm gonna do a little push down here. You see, I just stretch my leg as I'm going, look. And then come up. All right? If I try to go that way, and Monique try to go to the other way now, I'm gonna lift my elbow, switch to cut the elbow, I will do exactly the same thing with my legs. That's the good thing about butterfly. If she's blocking me really well for one side, she will expose herself to the other side. And I already have the grips. I just need to switch my hip, not my grip, switch my hip. And that's taking me a lot of time. I will be away ahead from her. Okay, it makes me a good option. Okay, let's go again. On the angle, the point is here. Okay. I have it here, I force her to pose. Under, okay, as I lean backwards, I know she wanna pose, all right? And then I'm gonna track the look here, and then track, all right? She keeps the elbow down here, that's perfect. See how her hand is down? Just go back, all right? If she's not going back, if she's not to reach the other way, I lift my elbow, the hand go from behind the blade here to the elbow, pull the elbow in, lift the other elbow, kick, and just get out. You guys get the motion with my leg. Whatever side I sweep, I sweep that side. The opposite leg kick over. All right? And the bottom leg do a little touch. Just push the leg. That way she's gonna put the bottom and make my leg a little All right? I will show again. Before I show again, guys, have any questions so far? No? No questions? Yes. Is there a lift with your underfoot when it's sweeping? Yes. I use my under, my arm to shoot keeping her body over myself. I don't allow her to screw down. You know, because like in defense, probably she's gonna move her back, her back self back, back what you get herself backwards. And I want to stop there, I stop this with my grip, okay? Make sure I keep everything nice and tight, and then I lift you whatever way I go, I lift you to go to the opposite way, okay? All right, one more time. Again, here, okay, push on the hook, go under, look, it's important to my toe be light, okay guys, I'm here, I'm gonna use my toe to pull the butt, and I do this. That way, her weight come. You guys pay attention to her butt. All right, she's completely down on the, on the heel right, right now, right? And I'm going down with her butt. Completely off the floor, right? She's really light now. Okay, not because she's light. Let me grab some pizza. Come on, some pizza jump here, please. Come on. Look, it's like gonna be the same, okay? I'm here, 
All right? He's here? Now look, I can't believe too much really easy. I can't do it. Because he's late on his arms, you know? I'm out with the strength on my strength. Out he's late on his hands, you know? They help me. That's why I want to force him to pose. That way he put out the weight on the, on the shoulders, and then the leg becomes super light. Okay? All right? And now we'll finish here. Like right, let's say, I trap. You kick his elbow down, just so much. All right? If he's not to reach the other side, I'm going to switch. Grab the elbow. Bring the elbow in. We just go to the other side. Okay? Most of the time, when you switch to the opposite side, and wrap the arm, I end up in the wrong position. That would be better. Okay? Question? No? All right, let's go back. One, two, three.